I'm making this video because I posted a video with the XA70 and the DJI Mini 3 Pro at Red Rock and I got asked some questions. One person asked me to film indoors, so here we are indoors with just a overhead light and whatever natural lighting there is. If I turn off the light, here's just the natural light. Obviously that doesn't look good. If you want, you can buy different types of uh, lighting that's uh, not expensive. But I want to film completely out of the box, run and gun. I imagine people that are buying this type of camera just want to pick it up and go. That's what I want to do. You want to set your ISO, your aperture. You can do all that stuff and should. You know, you want to film hyper lapses or whatever kind of stuff. You know, I would think mostly people would get a DSLR for that kind of stuff. For me, I have a little Sony ZV-1 that runs out of batteries all the time. And I'm really happy with the ZV-1 for what I use it for, but this is just stable. It has a long lasting battery. I have two 256 gigabyte cards. When one 256 runs out, you can go into the next. So you can just keep going. I did have to buy an extra battery because it only came with one. But when I filmed the Hummingbirds and put my music behind it, I realized people might want to know about the slow motion on the Sony XA70. So there are two modes you can film in, 0.4 and 0.8. When you're filming in 0.4, I think that's the way to go because when you're filming at 0.4, you can shoot at a frame rate of uh, 60 frames per second. Two minutes equals five minutes of film. So two minutes of filming gets stretched out to five minutes. If you film in the 0.8, that's 24p and 35 megabytes per second. So four minutes of filming equals five minutes of film. So you can see it's not that slow of a slow motion. So for hummingbirds, I set it to 0.4 and the only option is 1080p. From what I can see so far, I don't think there's any way to film slow-mo at 4K and you, unless you slow it down in post. So here is a video, slow motion, hummingbirds on a tripod. I got another question, what's it like handheld? Maybe I'll make another video for that to check out the stabilization. Again, I'm not a reviewer. I'm not on YouTube to do reviews of cameras. There are guys that do such a great job that, you know, they're in Iceland coming down a great big cliff and it opens up to the rising sun and... I'm not that guy, okay? I just bought the XA70 to run and gun. I like to travel around the world. I just want to hit the button and start filming when cool stuff happens. Keep it in the car with me and pull it up and film and just get going. I find with the DSLR, again, I'm not much of a cameraman. Don't think that I'm Peter McKinnon. I'm not, okay? Uh, I don't want to fiddle with a whole bunch of stuff before I start filming because then you miss what you're filming. And I don't want to run out of batteries and have all this complicated stuff. This rig, you can just pretty much grab it and go and hit play. So those are the videos that I'm making. Let's roll the video of the hummingbirds in the very beginning. The fuzzy shot is with the Sony ZV-1. And in the ending, the fuzzy shot where I'm... I just got back from riding my electric scooter. I'm Dagwood Streets, host of the Electric Scooter Podcast. If you're into scooters, check out my podcast. But I just got back from a ride and saw the Hummingbird, had the ZV-1, the Sony ZV-1 in my hand, so I filmed it over my shoulder. So that's the very intro and the outro. The rest of it is all with the Sony XA70 shot on the Kayer tripod. I love it. It's a great tripod. I wouldn't travel with it anywhere, but it's great for around the house. Did I answer everything? Maybe I'll make another video on the XA70 if you have more questions. If you have more questions, shoot. Let's roll the tape.
need a pound of ground round We will paint the town brown If you don't think this song If you don't think that this song Is the best song in the world I will fight you I just might fight you Mm-hmm. <laughs>